What's going on, everybody? So it seems that paper lead vendors are coming out of nowhere. And we want to break down how to determine the best paper lead vendor for you and your business. That's what we're going to be covering in this video today. All right. So let me go ahead and uh, share a little uh, cheat sheet that I've got. And this is our roadmap. We have a nine step process on how we scale real estate investors. Um, and getting guaranteed inbound leads is one of those key components. Now, stick till the end because I'm going to provide you a link of a cheat sheet that you can use to put to use in your business, right? So what are the steps really? Well, before we get into, you know, all the intricacies of, of guaranteed inbound leads or paper lead vendors, it's important for you to have an acquisition system that can actually have the the ability to intake those leads and nurture and set appointments for you 24-7. Um, because if not, you're going to miss out on 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 your uh, investment. Now, with that said, this second step around guaranteed inbound leads and paper lead vendors, the, the reason why we're such fans of it is because it removes a lot of the complexity of having to run ads for yourself and you don't have the skill risk. What is the skill risk? Meaning you do not need to essentially know how to run Google pay-per-click. You do not need years to set up an SEO website or meta ads, right? Or Facebook ads. And so with that said, it's if you have an acquisition system, meaning you have a system that can take leads coming in, records everything, sets appointments, and then you can put fuel to the fire right? You can feed it with guaranteed inbound leads. Now it's all about closing. Now it's all about sales and we can definitely always improve sales. So what is the steps to actually make guaranteed inbound leads work for you? Well, the first one is you want to make sure you have about four months worth of capital available and you can ask around, you know, what are some of the common numbers for cost per closing? Because that's usually the sales cycle, 90 to 120 days. All right. You want to identify a proven plug and play a lead generation system that gives you exclusive leads and you want to understand what are what are the KPIs to be expected so how many leads you know should i be talking to uh, what is my cost per closing and ultimately what is the return on ad spend a lot of real estate investors are skeptical about investing in marketing but without a lead to talk to there's no property there's no inventory there's no deal to be made all right, so I want to invite you to check out wififlips.com forward slash PPL, and you'll be able to download a free uh, cheat sheet that we have put together on some of the minimum criteria you should evaluate before investing into paper lead generation, right? There's some minimum criteria such as you should be able to get refunded if it's listed, if it's not in your territory. Um, if they're not doing a life transfer, how fast are they doing that? Okay. And we cover this extensively in our Wi-Fi flips university, where we have weekly coaching calls, monthly workshops, and access to all of our legacy courses. So hopefully that helps go and check it out. Wi-Fi flips.com forward slash BPL. And I'll see you guys on the next video. God bless.